Alternative Dispute Resolution, a relatively new within Dominica justice system. However, strides are being made to advance this method of conflict resolution. Mediation is a major part of ADR, which also involves other methods such as arbitration and negotiation. In light of this, a mediation committee has been formed on the island as part of the Canadian-funded project Impact Justice, which refers to improved access to justice in the Caribbean. And this committee is looking for, to form a community mediation association to serve as a national network for the provision of professional mediation services here in Dominica. Attorney at law, Noreen Joseph, who serves as the chairperson of that committee, says citizens will have access to mediators within the major communities around the island. Focus is on communities. We will hopefully identify areas, centers, where persons in the, in the community will go directly to those centers, to mediators in those communities. It's a, it's a, it's a community-focused initiative. There may be matters coming from the courts who will find themselves to those centers or working with mediators, but at this stage it's not envisaged that the court will refer persons. It may very well happen, but it's not a court-directed initiative. It's going to be in the community. It's a community-oriented mediation service. A number of individuals have already been trained by Impact Justice to resolve conflicts through mediation. The association, when formed, will take on several responsibilities, such as educating the public on mediation, serving as mediators, liaising with other relevant entities to achieve all the objectives under its constitution. Impact Justice has already taken similar steps for the formation of a community mediation association in Barbados, and next on the agenda is setting up of associations in Belize, Grenada, Guyana, and St. Kitts and Nevis, with a view to eventually forming a regional umbrella body.